The tight knit community forever changed by a deadly tornado outbreak on March 5th, 2022 came together tonight. Six people died along one stretch of road in Madison County. Another man died in Lucas County as a twister touched down in a campground. These are the victims. Two year old Owen, five year old Kinley, Mike Bolger and Melissa Baisley are all part of the same family. Rodney Clark died, died while shielding his wife. Cecilia Lloyd died while searching for a safe spot and Jesse Fisher died when a different tornado tore into his camper. Newbridge Church in Winterset served as the main center for relief efforts and today it was a place where residents reflected, prayed and remembered the victims. KCCI's Bo Bowman is in Madison County to show us the emotional memorial. The Madison County community all came together here at the New Bridge Church in Winterset to remember the lives lost one year ago. Few eyes were dry in Winterset Sunday night as the community gathered on the first anniversary of the deadly tornado that ravaged their small town. And losing my uncle was incredibly heartbreaking. Stephanie Craig lost her aunt Cecilia Lloyd in the tornado. Her uncle Tom Lloyd initially survived but died just last month surrounded by family. Craig and other families shared their thanks for the support from the Madison County community. Generosity, care, love, hard work, determination, and a willingness to open their arms to us even though we were complete strangers. Abby Sawyer lost her aunt, Melissa Baisley. It's always fascinating how people can come together in the, in the midst of terrible events. She says she felt the love from everyone in the church the same way she has felt over the last year as the people of Madison County came together to help. It's a very warming feeling. It's it's a good reminder that people want to do good. Not everyone in the crowd lost a loved one, but everyone who insisted on being at the service is proof of the continued grief they all still bear one year later. God called me to be here. I needed the closure. In the face of absolute tragedy, we witnessed a community give their all and stay Winterset strong. In Winterset, Bo Bowman, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.